this video I'm going to be giving you the top five Blitzes post patch in Madden 25 and coming in at number five on our list is the 3-4 odd defense. To set this up you're going to want to have auto flip off in your coach adjustments and you're going to want to be in the play pinch bug zero. Now there's really not much of a setup for this blitz. If you want to coverage out one of your linebackers you can or you can just send six. If we want to we can just coverage out the linebacker that is on the running back side. We're going to put our user in whatever zone that we want and as you're going to see this blitz is going to scream with SM5, and then if your opponent does decide to go ahead and block their running back, then you can always send six and still get that edge pressure at the quarterback. Coming in at number four on our list is the nickel 2-4 double mug blitz, and this is post-patch, and the way you're going to set this blitz up is you're going to have your auto flip on. You're going to be using the play mid blitz zero. If you want to do this out of a zone look so that your corners don't move, you can do so out of really any zone look, but I like to use mid blitz for this. And kind of similar to the 3-4 odd. Now the way that I like to set this blitz up is we are just going to press coverage. If you want to show blitz, that'll bring this left side safety in, and then you're going to be using this player right here. Kind of like with 3-4 odd, we can take this left side defensive end and man him up to the running back. And what you're going to see is if they send all five receivers on a route, you're going to consistently get this edge pressure off of the non running back side and then if we are anticipating that they might be blocking their running back this time we're going to send that guy on the left side and as you can see we're still going to be able to get instant pressure at the quarterback coming in at number three on our list is the four three even six one defense we're going to turn our auto flip off for this we're going to have our auto alignment on base we could be using really any play in the formation i prefer to use cover four quarters and we're going to be flipping the defensive play what you're going to see is we're just going to come out and we are going to show blitz to get the safeties down into the box. We're going to shift our defensive line to the left. We're going to slant our defensive line to the left. And then we're going to go ahead and blitz this linebacker off the right side. Feel free to put him in a QB contain as well. And then you can adjust the coverage however you want. And what you're going to see is off this right edge, this linebacker is going to get you instant pressure at the quarterback. This also has really good uh, sheds as well as a four-man disengage blitz. Probably won't be able to get it in practice mode as it's a little just better in game, but occasionally you can get this deep at the tackle to kind of loop around the center and be able to get instant pressure at the quarterback. So 6-1 is a good blitzing defense, but it doesn't have that same send 6 ability, but the send 5 is really good out of 6-1. This is just very quick pressure. You're pretty much always going to get that animation and get that linebacker at the quarterback. Coming in at number two on our list is going to be the gun bunch, or I'm sorry, not the gun bunch, the um, the dime three two formation or the dollar formation. This is in the Jets, the 49ers uh, playbook, this thing as well as the Texans and the multiple defensive playbook and the Chiefs playbook. And this formation is really good because you are able to have a lot of different types of blitzes from the same look. So in your audibles, you want to have cover six Willie. You want to have DB fire two, and you want to have edge blitz three, and you're going to be flipping your formation. So make sure you have auto flip off and auto alignment on base. You're going to flip double safety go, and the first blitz we're going to show you is out of the cover six Willie. What I like to do with this look is I'm going to yellow zone the slot corner, shade coverage down, and then create a cover two on the right. You want to stand out here with your user, and as you can see, you're going to get this loop pressure at the quarterback. The next blitz we're going to show you is out of the edge blitz. Three. This is the same exact pre-snap look as the other blitz that we just showed you. And now we're just going to create a cover four look. And this is really good because you're going to get a different type of pressure and still really effective pressure at the quarterback. And then the last blitz that you have access to within this is some slot corner pressure. Now, uh, the beauty with this one is when they start to run a lot of play action plays and they start to want to um, just try to do different things to block your four man loop blitzes, then you're gonna to go to something like this. All you're gonna do is send four off of one of the sides. You can just contain and you'll see that this slot corner, a lot of times will loop around the quarterback, especially if they're doing a bunch of different protections. A lot of people like to double team the uh, defensive tackle to try to block some of the, some of the A-gap blitzes. And as you see, that's gonna open up both edges for this edge pressure. Another thing that you can do, and what we see a lot of people do is they'll slide to the left side to try to block the blitz. If they're doing that, you can see I'm just slightly a little bit more inside here. And at the snap of the ball, now you're just going to run down at the center. And you see that that slot corner is going to loop around for the pressure. So number two on our list is the dime 3-2. And lastly, coming in at number one on our list is going to be 
this nickel three three five odd. This is a really, really, really good defense. If you want to learn any of the defenses we've talked about throughout this video, make sure that you're joining our school community. That will be linked in the description below. But what we want to do here is I'm just going to show you first and foremost, coach adjustments, auto pop off, auto alignment to base. If we come out here in Hot Blitz 3 and we try to run it basic, you're going to see that if I try to move this guy out here, he is going to actually move back to the line of scrimmage, back to where he was originally. So what we want to do is we want to utilize a specific package that is going to make this defense significantly, significantly better. And that package that we want to use is the CB1 inside package. From there, you're going to utilize this play Hot Blitz 3. And your setup is you're just going to show blitz. You're going to pinch your defensive line. You're going to slant your defensive line inside. QB contain. You're going to slide this guy out like so. And then you're basically free to make whatever adjustments that you want. This is a really good five-man pressure. As you see, we're able to get double edge pressure at the quarterback. What this also allows you to do is, based off of kind of what formation you're playing, like in this case, we're playing a bunch formation, we're now able to do things like send four off of one side. So as you see here, we're just gonna send four off this left side. And as you see, we get that nice clean pressure off of that side. And then once they start to block their running back, or once they start to maybe change how they're running their formation, we can send five off of the other side as well. So it might look something like this. And as you see, this send five loops around and you get nice clean pressure at the quarterback. Again, guys, I wanna thank you for watching the video. These are my top five blitzes in the game right now. And if you wanna learn my full defensive breakdowns on any of these formations we talked about, everything is in our school community. If you're not a member of school yet, make sure you head down to the description and click the link down below to sign up for just 10 bucks today.